what up y'all welcome back to another video it's not really a video video it's just me testing out this camera on this computer that i got this camera has all these uh it's got a webcam on it so like you know i was trying to figure out how to record videos from a computer for the longest time instead of using my damn phone all the time and do reaction videos so my computer broken as you guys know my computer broke it took a shit it don't work no more it's done like dinner it's done like mother effing dinner um the hell was that what the fuck oh that star chef online cooking game it's not as bright in my room because i have one of those smart light bulbs y'all ever get a smart light bulb before you can turn on and off your light by your phone but um yeah so y'all know that my computer broke it doesn't work. It's crashed. It's done. It overheated, and I think the motherboard flat or fried. So I'm using another computer. It's an older computer, but it seems to work really well. And it's like a better. This computer is old, cause it's a computer that was given to my mother, and I need a computer for school and all that other shit. And I was going crazy on my computer, so I'm borrowing my mother's computer that she has gotten as a gift, cause she has her own desktop downstairs or whatever. Um, so I was talking to my girlfriend, I was just like, yo, my computer is fried, it is done, she'll try and take it to the tech center, I did all that bullshit. I took it into somebody and they said, it's, uh, the, it's done, it's fried, because I was like, it's, it's on, but like I said, you hear it on, but nothing's happening. Boop. Ow, I just hurt my nose. <laughs> oh. But anyway, oh, I got some fireball too, y'all want to shot a fireball? Do you? I don't know how. The, I don't even know where the fuck it is. <laughs> it's right here. Oh wait, maybe I drank it and didn't realize. My cat is just flipping out. But anyway, I took it to this one computer place. Yo, wait, let me tell. I took this one computer place that I, my mom took her computer to when it broke the first time. This place called AZ Computer Repairs or whatever, right? So my mom's computer was not working her desktop downstairs wasn't working so she took it to this guy that used to be on the corner of my street that's what she said <laughs> but anyway um she took it to this guy right so she took it to him and he looked at it and fixed it boom got her computer back so then right after the warranty expires right after the warranty expires on my laptop my asus asus that computer is a piece of crap and i will never get one again because it broke after the warranty had expired so here i go calling customer service thank you for calling so and so this is blah blah blah, blah. you know that call center bullshit 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 call center shit so I gave them the serial number. They're like, unfortunately, this computer's out of warranty, so we can't help you. Bitch, what do you mean you can't help me? When I was working at a computer, when I was working at a call center, if something was out of warranty, I still help the person, bitch. I did a one-time courtesy. They don't do that, clearly. Clearly, they don't do that shit. Ugh. So I said, okay, fine, whatever. So I kept trying to call. I, I wanted to take it up to the place that my mom took her computer up to. I went up there, and it was closed, not realizing that it was completely empty. Went up there, it was closed, okay? Fine, maybe it's closed on Sundays. Went up there on Monday. Closed still. Okay, maybe it's closed on Sundays and Mondays. Went up there again. Closed again. I call them and I'm like, yeah, um, where are you guys? Are you guys open? Because I wanted to bring my computer in there. He's like, yeah, well, we're in another location. And I'm like, you're in another location? He's like, yeah. And I'm like, or he said, we're in another location right now. And I'm like, oh, oh, well, can I bring my computer? Where are you guys are? He's like, where are you guys at? He's like, don't go to something, 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 Taylor Road or some shit. Some, oh no, Lee and Harvard, or he said some ghetto ass shit in the ghetto of, of Cleveland. But anyway, um, I was like, okay, well, I'll just wait till you guys come back and open back up tomorrow at 9 a.m. So I go up there the next day at 9 a.m. thinking that he's going to be there and it's closed again. I look in there, empty completely empty like this place just disappeared like there it just shut down there was no equipment there was no nothing just an empty space and i was like whoa what the hell so i called him again and he's and i'm like well you guys said you guys were in another location where are you he gave me the address and i'm like okay well i'm gonna come up there and i told you i think i told you guys and he said i'm not i'm not there yet i'm not there yet and i'm like you're not there yet how are you gonna have a business and not be there yet sus as Bro, tell me that wasn't sus. Sus as hell. 
<laughs> that was cool, wasn't it? Oh my god, this is crazy as fuck. So I'm like, okay. He's like, I'm gonna have to meet you there. And I'm like, huh? He's like, where are you? And I'm like, well, I'm still in my area, in my suburb of Cleveland. I live in. He's like, oh, okay, well, give me, a, give me a second. I'm like, okay, so can you call me when you get there? He's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Gives me the address. Sus as fuck, right? So I look up this address, right? I look up this address, and it's a fucking abandoned warehouse. An abandoned mother freaking warehouse, y'all. An abandoned warehouse. If that doesn't say sex trafficking, I don't know what the hell does. You feel me? Like, <laughs> there's a lot of little features on here, too. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm looking at this, I'm looking at this, and I'm like, this is literally an abandoned warehouse. And I'm like, huh? And then a light bulb just came off in my head. And I'm like, that's sex trafficking right there. He was going to have me meet him at this abandoned warehouse. He was going to come from behind me with some chloroform, put a rag over my face, and kidnap me. And I'll wake up chained to a bed. Literally. Sus as hell. And I'm like, what the? F no. And I showed my mom. And I'm like, no. no. My mom's like, no, 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 no. Yeah, I'm a, I'll, be, I'll be on a Lifetime movie. I would totally be on a damn Lifetime movie. That's for sure. So I took it to this other place called Cleveland Heights Computer or some shit. I don't even know. Um, and I went in there and I said, can you guys... I called them. And I said, are you guys open? You guys fix computers? And he's like, yeah, what's going on with it? I told him that my computer is on. You can tell that it's on, but you, you it, there's no screen. I was like, I saw my little spe my Spice Girl background. I saw my Spice Girl background, right? And I'm um, calling the world spice up your life. Every boy and every girl spice up your Where's my fireball, yo? I'm curious. No damn well I did not drink. Did I drink that shit? I must have drank. No, I must have threw it. Oh, here it is. It's there goes my hydrochlorophyte zine. Whatever this shit is. But anyway, yeah, so I told I explained it to him on the phone. He's like, bring it in, right? So I'm like, okay. Um, I bring it in, find a place, tell him he he said it's right by CBS where I used to work, right? So, um, I take it in, and he looks at it, and I'm like, yeah, he's like, you got the charger? I'm like, it's right there. So he looks at it, right? He turns it on. He's like, oh, I hear that. It's on. I'm like, yeah, the power light's on. He's like, but I hear I hear it. I hear it on. And he's like, well, did it get hot? And I'm like, yeah, it got really, really hot. He's like, oh, well, it's done. It's done. It's donezo. And I'm like, it's donezo. And he's like, yeah, it's done. I'm like, how do you know? He's like, well, if it over, it probably overheated, and the motherboard is fried. It's fried. That's what happened. And I'm like, well, that makes sense because that let me make sure this computer ain't getting hot. Cause shit, that computer was like hot all the time, like constantly hot, nonstop. And it used to be loud, but it was quiet. I was just so ashamed, so upset. And then I tried to call the Geek Squad, and they said it's gonna be like a seventy-five dollar charge just to fucking troubleshoot it or some bullshit. And I'm like, you know what? Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. Got time for that. Ain't nobody got time for that. Anyway, don't make that into a video, please. So, I'm like, okay. So, he tried to sell me another grade. He said, here, give me this Dell laptop. Dell. Ooh, wait, no. If you know about Dells, you know about Dells. Dells are supposed to be, like, the worst computer there is, apparently. So, then, my mom's computer that she was given to her, she has an HP Envy. Beats by Dre computer, so I'm like, well, maybe I'll just use this one. Has Windows 7, and I'm like, oh my god, this shit has Windows 7, and I gotta go through all this bullshit. I couldn't go to websites when I tried to connect to the websites, um, because it would say, your connection is not secure. You cannot go to this website. Some dumbass shit. Like, some dumb, crazy shit. Mm. That computer lived a good life. It lived a good life. And now it's done. It overheated. So I did a whole white clean. I did all this. I did all these troubleshooting steps. And I'm like, why is it not letting me go to these websites? So then I'm like, hmm, maybe if I put Windows 10 in this Windows 7 computer, because this computer is from 2016, I believe. Let me see. Um, Don't look at my boobs. Let me see. Okay, Google. When did the HP Envy 15 come out? October 15th, 2009. According to Wikipedia, Damn. HP originally launched the line on October 15, 2009 with two high-performance models, the NV13 and the NV15. Oh, my bad. 2009. Holy shit. 
<laughs> but my mom said that he said he got it in 2016. There's no way. Because when I went to the command system and I typed in system requirements, it did even say 2009. Damn. That's a long time. And look, it's working well. It's working better than that damn computer that I got last two, two years ago. Last year. It's an older computer and it works wonders. Like, it's good. It was slow at first, but like I said, I did all this bullshit and I had to go watch YouTube videos on how to install on Windows 10 into this Windows 7 computer. So I went to the Windows 7 thing, or I went to the website to download Windows 10, and it kept saying, um, you cannot download something. Something. And then I had to disable a bunch of certificates inside the computer, and then it finally let me download Windows 10. So then I'm like, all right, let me try and upgrade this old ass computer to Windows 11. So I tried to update, I tried to update it to Windows 11 and it said, well, this computer does not support Windows 11. So I did some other shit, did some computer shit, went into the command system, went into the inspection, all that shit, and installed Windows 11. Now I ain't got Windows 11 in this computer. So where was I going with this story? Because I totally forgot. <laughs> where was I going with this? I don't even remember, y'all. Oh, I do remember. So, yeah, that's what happened with that one. So, I'm going to, like, just use this one until I can get another computer. But, shit, I might not need one. This computer is actually pretty well, and it works really good on Windows 11. And once I install Windows 11 in this old-ass computer, it, it goes faster. My games work. My Sims 4 work. Because I was wor that was one of the things I was worried about. My, my games and me attending school because a lot of my classes are going to be online. I do want to go to campus because I do got to see somebody when the class, when school starts back up in August. Got to take a certain class and see a certain somebody who I love more than anything in the world who's my girlfriend. I'm going to take her class. Fucking spy on her ass. Bitch. Watch her like a hawk. Like, mm. Why are you flirting with that student? You see me right here? Do you not see me right here? Hello? 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 Oh, she gonna be saying this. You doing too much. You, uh, Of course I'm doing too much. Why are you looking at him like that? You want him, bitch? You want him? Go be with him. Because you shouldn't be looking at him like, no, I'm just playing. I'm not that crazy. Anyway, I'm just playing. But anyway. Long story short. I was worried about my Sims 4 games that I downloaded. Because I spent about $300, $400 worth of Sims games. I, got, I had Fortnite. I had Battlefield. I had Call of Duty. I had all this shit. And this computer even has more memory than my computer. My, mem my computer only had 500 gigabytes. This one has like 800. And then my external hard drive I attached to to play The Sims 2 and 3. But it goes faster. And then that stupid private security bullshit was, it went away. So, I'm going to use this for now, as much as long as I can, because it's like a brand new computer all over again, because it works wonders. So, I'm messing around with this computer, and I see this, and I'm like, wait a minute. <laughs> I'm like, this has UCAM on here, because my other computer, I couldn't record video. I didn't, I couldn't, it didn't work right when it did video, like whatever the fuck, I don't know. It didn't have Cyberlink, whatever the hell this is. It didn't have that on that computer. Like, I was trying to figure out how to like record videos and upload them to YouTube on that Asus that I got uh, maybe a year, two years ago. And it didn't, wasn't working at all. It wouldn't even like, it wouldn't even let me record. I had to like download some program or whatever. So I'm like, I wonder if this computer will let me upload videos to my YouTube. And apparently, I'm testing this out. That's the point of this whole story here. So, if you have a 2009 computer, and you don't want to get rid of it, and you still have Windows 7, and you want to know how to put Windows 11 into it, let me know, because I can give you a step-by-step -step on how to freaking do it. You got to be computer savvy. You got to know what shit means, because you're going to have to go to the command prop. You're going to have to type some stuff in command prop. You're going to have to go to Google Chrome. You're going to have to click... Um, what did I click? You have to click, um, developer tools, you have to t clip, you have to click on no more tools, and then a bunch of HTML coding. You have to know how to code. There you go. You have to know how to code. If you don't know how to code, then Google it. Or I can try and help you with that. So if you do have an old computer, and you're not really ready to get rid of it, you can upgrade your, your old computer to Windows 11. Because even my dad's computer, Windows 2007, he had Windows Vista and that shit. And um, that computer died because that computer had Windows Vista in it. So I upgraded that to Windows 10. 
And we'll have to go from Windows Vista to Windows 7 to Windows 10. So you got to upgrade it in order. So you'd have to go from Windows 7 to 10, and then you have to go do this stuff in 10, do all this shit over again to download Windows 11. And boom, it works. Wonders. So anyways, don't even. This computer works fine. It works better. It's better than the damn shit I had. That's the one I had was supposed to be a gaming laptop that I got from Best Buy Gaming, but it completely sucks. Because it's broken. So I'm using this computer. And it seems to be working well. And I'm going to try and upload this video to YouTube and see if it works. But yeah. If you really. If you. Yeah. you I literally have Windows 11 in this old computer. So if you have an older computer. It's possible. It's possible. Right? <laughs> I'm doing too much with this shit. My bad, it's about to be a whole new, it's about to be a whole new thing. For real, for real. Oh, what is this? It even has little, oh. <laughs> what the fuck? Hello. Hello. Oh, that is so crazy, y'all. That is crazy. But anyway, I don't know how to turn this off. <laughs> what is that? Oh, I don't know. What, the, what is that? Get even more out of you, Kim, with free downloads. Oh, I don't know what that is. Oh, that's like upgrading. You always gotta upgrade some shit, so, yeah. How do I take this off? Oh, oh, what? Was that a spider? Oh, oh. Ah! Get away! Okay, I'm done. I'm done. But, yeah. Anyway. <laughs> Look at that. What is this? Oh, my. It has a bunch of editing. Sh oh, it's over now. Oh, it's over. It's a. It's over. Done. It has editing software and all that and, and, and all those cool little features that people be doing. And I can... Like, yeah, oh, it's over now, for real. But anyway, like I said, that was my random story. Now I was testing this out to see if it works. Anyway, if it's, oh, it's on. It is over. It is over and done with. Hey. So anyway, I'm going to see y'all soon. I'm going to see y'all soon. But for real, if you really want to know that you don't have to buy a brand new computer. If you don't have the money to spend on a new computer to get the new Windows software, hit me up, bro. Hit me up. And I can give you a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to go from Windows 7 to 10 to 11, even older computers. Because I did that, and this computer seems to be working fine. So I'm going to hold off on getting a new computer until this one completely and totally breaks down. But it seems to be working really fine. So anyway, if you guys stayed here and watched the whole video, thank you. Now I just got to find, I'm going to have to mess with this a little bit and find all the features. I might have to upgrade and pay for the upgrade of UCAM. Or, er, yeah. Anyway, hope you guys had a good Father's Day. Hope you guys had a good week. Hope you guys have a good week. I mean, hope you had a good weekend. Stay blessed if you're blessed. I love you to my girlfriend. Yeah, we're still together. Bitch, I'll be going to break up. We're going to get married, honey. <laughs> So, you better, <laughs> y'all better be prepared for a, a proposal, because I'm literally told y'all I'm going to propose that bitch. Niagara Falls. Oh, fuck. I gave it away. I hope she's not watching this video. Damn it. I'm not going to tell her when, though. Damn. she forget. she forget in, like, a week. Watch. Anyway, see you guys next video. Bye.